Okay, so hello to you. My name is Vlad for Vlad.com and this is actually finally a video that's actually dedicated to music. My channel is called MTS, which stands for Music Technology and Other Stuff. And uh, yeah, I didn't uh, review anything that's music related. Well, besides those headphones and that review is actually not that great, let's be honest. Okay, so what I have in here is uh, Audio Track Prodigy Cube Black Edition, because obviously color is now an addition. It's a sound card which is a USB and let's see the specs. It has a, it is 24 bit card, 96 kilohertz hi-fi USB audio and it has a high quality dual headphone amplifier. You can basically connect two headphones. There is a big and a small jack but we'll see that later. Um, it has a stereo analog RCA line outputs which are we call them chinch. Um, a Sony Philips digital interface, coaxial and optical digital outputs, and microphone preamp because, well, microphone preamp is awesome. Compatible with Windows, OS X, uh, what not. Okay, let's see. And here, so interface is USB 1.1 or 2.0, analog input is mono, it's microphone. I actually bought this uh, just because. Uh, <laughs> I recorded a couple of videos and my sound sucked. Then I bought a new uh, headphone, a new sorry, new uh, new microphone, and it still sucked. So I kind of do hope that this solves the problem. Otherwise, I will spend about 150 bucks for nothing. So that would suck. Okay, let's see. Compatibility Windows 8, 7, Vista XP, obviously Windows 10. It's powered by USB, which is nice. So uh, let's open and see. Uh, what do we get inside? I actually did not open this. So, ta -da. Okay, so the unboxing experience. Audio track. Okay. As you can see here, uh, you get four rubber feet. And uh, what well, it seems like a you know, manual, user's guide. So, I'll be seeing that later. Okay, let's remove the cube. And see what do we what else do we have? Okay, this is USB cable which is standard, USB 1.1 or 2.0. And we get these beautiful RCA cables, which well I don't know whether they're high quality or not. Kind of look this uh, this type of uh, big uh, installation is not uh, necessarily a good thing because wiring inside probably sucks. Let's see how crazy am I. Do I need these cables? No. Let's see how thick these cables are from the inside. Fuck it. Okay. Uh, yeah, and as you can see, there is actually this cable is well laughable at best. So let's see how many wires are there inside. So yeah, these kind of big cables usually are all crap. So basically. If you remove all the plastic, eh, this does look half decent to be honest. But uh, yeah, there are not too many wires in there. So, to the recycle bin. Okay, now let's see. Well, that's basically it. So, let's see what do we have inside. This is the sound card. Okay. Sound card looks nice. This is a, probably a switch either to output or to uh, headphones. There are dual um, jacks and a microphone. And I think this is a volume rocker. Well, mm, kind of shitty. To be honest, this is pretty light. It's. Uh, Hmm. Not pleased so far. Um, so we have RCA outputs. This is USB, optical, and SP Sony Philips digital interface, which is optical and um, coaxial. Okay, um, let's see what's inside. As long as I'm opening it, what the hell? I will be using it, this one. So we'll see the brand of the caps inside and well everything else. Now this is not necessarily a bad sound card. 
I read a couple of reviews and it <clears throat> people said that it was good but yeah people usually say that everything they own is good so okay this actually looks nice there are a couple of capacitors inside let's see the brand AHS could be known one to be honest I'm not quite sure but yeah it does look actually rather nice let's see whether this is uh, whether the amplifier uh, has separate channels or is it just one in parallel okay uh, to be honest inside it does not look that bad but uh, yeah it is quite light okay let's see the only replaceable part basically there is a quality check nice capacitors um, so there is no wiring whatsoever which is nice no jumpers no hot wiring yeah it does look nice um, so again uh, the technical specification is well I threw it away somewhere I mean, by, by Spikes it is have decent sound cards, so uh, the next video uh, you'll hear from me will be recorded with this thing and I do hope that there is no noise and hiss. I, at first I thought it was my UPS because my computer is connected to my UPS but I've tried everything. I even bought new Audio-Technica mic, condenser mic and it helped but not, uh, not that much. This. Okay, now, now this is actually way better, so obviously it's maybe something with this. Maybe it's touching. Ah, yes, you can see. If I remove this thing, it will probably move better. Okie dokie. There you go. Move. This kind of sucks. Well, there you have it. I'll be recording. This looks like low quality knob truly does well anyway I'll be recording a next video with this sound card and if you have any questions please ask oh there is a jumper <laughs> you actually have 16 bit and 24 bit which is a uh, hardwired hmm, interesting why didn't they put a switch it would be nice well anyway there you have it this will probably fail as soon as some dust gets in but uh, yeah looks nice there you have it if you have any questions please do ask don't hesitate to ask and have a good day what else to say so a couple of things first of all the device is actually detected as SPDF interface which is interesting even though it is audio so basically the entire conversion is done conversion is done in uh, inside of a card which is nice so there's that and now uh, let's test uh, to see the sound of this device and uh, I will play it back to you now bear in mind I will play it back to you I won't, I won't be doing a screen capture but uh, play it back to you to, so that you can hear what camcorder hears so let's give it a go and uh, I will be using my Audio Technica mic so uh, let's see how good this thing is so I started the uh, professional tool, sound recorder, let's go. So hello YouTube, this is uh, just a quick test to see whether this thing is a good device or not. Okay, saving to desktop, whatever. So hello YouTube, this is uh, just a quick test to see whether this thing is a good device or not. This is actually awesome, no noise whatsoever. Big thumbs up. Okay, have a good day.